a gay mark of this production. Hi guys, what's up? Returning to my Grand Theft Auto 5 videos, I decided to split a character profile into three parts. I will make three separate videos for each character, starting with Michael for today. Although I am going to be continuing to use the top 5 format, most of the items on the list are pretty much interchangeable. Without further hesitation, here is my character profile of Michael DeSanta. Number 5 First off, we recently learned that Michael was once best friends with Trevor. Now if you have watched any of the trailers you will know that Trevor is... unhinged to say the least. Considering that Michael used to be close to him suggests a couple of things to me. Perhaps Michael was once a lot like Trevor. Many have said that Michael is the GTA protagonist that got out unscathed. Maybe this reformed family man did something terrible, psychotic things in his life that he would rather forget. This is further suggested by Michael's reaction to Trevor in the latest trailer, where he is much less than pleased to see him. His panic to me says that Trevor represents something he wants to forget, someone who forces him to face the skeletons in his closet. Or maybe the two used to be in the army together. It has been said that Trevor is an ex-military pilot, so maybe Michael has connections to the army in some other way. This is further suggested considering Michael's proficiency for gun accuracy, given his ability to slow time to aim. Number 4 I don't know about you guys, but the safe houses of GTA 4 never really impressed me. They just simply served the purpose of a save point and a wardrobe. In GTA 5, however, Michael at least will be getting a mansion of a safe house, complete with outdoor pool and picturesque scenery. Although I've heard that Michael will begin the game in a hotel, but hopefully this section won't last for too long. Number 3 So far we know that Michael is for some reason part of a witness protection program. This may even explain why he begins the game in a hotel, as a high profile mansion would make him stick out like a sore thumb. I find this to be quite an interesting dynamic, because this creates a character who owes a debt to the state and law for giving him a new identity. This may create some conflict when it comes to committing crimes. Number 2 In the GTA trailers you may have noticed that some of the missions look pretty extravagant, and this is largely down to Michael's passion for old crime movies. Rather than going perhaps the most effective route, Michael would rather set up an elaborate and overcomplicated plan just to emulate his heroes. This clip in particular looks far more exciting than anything in GTA 4, with Michael rappelling down the side of a building and shooting through the glass. As I pointed out in my analysis video, there looks to be a lot of explosive action when it comes to bank heists as well. No doubt this is down to Michael's dramatic flair. It's number one. Michael, like John Marston from Red Dead, has the ability to slow time so that he can shoot with enhanced precision. As I have speculated, this could be perhaps due to his ties with the army, or maybe just his experience in the world of crime. Using this ability, it will be easier to target non-lethal sections of the body, or even disarming opponents if you can get the angle on them. Apparently, it is even possible to ignite a gas trail coming from a car should the cat be shot off. I feel that Michael will benefit most from this addition, as his precision should allow him to destroy cars even in a hectic gunfight. If any of you have ever played Max Payne, you can appreciate the extra level of fun that slow-mo gunplay brings to a shooter. This is especially true of GTA, where precision may be needed to shoot a car driver or even a helicopter pilot. Thank you for watching this character profile of Michael DeSanta. Expect an analysis of Franklin to be up sometime soon as well. Who is your favourite character from GTA 5? Let me know in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching and see you next time.